Yo guys, what's up? In this video, I'm going to show you guys how you can make money in a down market. Okay guys, so with that being said, we're going to start this. Um, I just want to tell you guys, um, I'm not at my best today. Um, my right eye, I woke up, it was blurry. Um, it's done it before and it kind of works its way out, but my left eye is perfectly fine. My right eye, I can't really see out of it that well. It's really blurry um, unless I move my eyelid just right with that being said I want to go ahead get this video up for you guys since I haven't got a video up in about a week so everybody's all these messages I've been having is how can we make money when the market's going down and that's exactly gonna how I'm gonna show you what to do um, and that's shorting shorting is borrowing shares and then selling them back at a lower price and you make the difference um, so with that being said, this one, the market has been down all day. Um, it, Yeah, it's not looking too good. Um, and I, or SPY, SPY is usually the ticker that I figure out from there. As you can see, I have a trend line on the top of this one. Um, but it didn't even make it up to my trend line. I actually shorted it at 760 because I saw the momentum was already swinging down. Um, and as you can see, 760 right here. I didn't... I was basically risking it off of it holding this. If it held, I was just going to and pop back up. I was going to obviously cut my losses, but I was more banking off of it was falling at 760 and it did exactly what I kind of expected to. Um, I'm showing you this part because this is where the trend started going downwards. I just caught the main swing of it. I ended up covering down the 720s. So as you can see, a good chunk of profit off this. But it is starting to bounce back a little bit. Um, it's probably going to fall further. Um, it'll probably get down here one more time for today, around 7.15. Um, but I'm done for the day. I made a good chunk of profit off this one, so I am absolutely done. But you can predict when things are falling due to price action, level 2. Um, level 2 is this down here, if you guys don't know tells you the amount of shares that are trying to be traded um, and what price on the bid or the ask um, and then what market maker or whatever. So, and then this is what's actually being ran through and basically buys and sells that have been confirmed through the system. So, with this being said, this was a really predictable one just because of the trend line um, and then being able to watch support and resistance. So all the things that I've taught one by one, so support and resistance, trend lines, um, volume, what you're doing is you're tying them all together. And that's in my course, that's what I tell you that, or I teach you guys how to do is I teach it all one by one, very simple process of it all. And then we tie it all together to make it where it all works at once. You see how I do it um, in my course. And I'm saying this because people ask me all the time, like, you teach this, you teach this, and you teach this, but why is it not all together? And I'm like, that's what my, that's exactly what my course does because that seems to be the hardest thing for people to understand. Now, this one I thought was the perfect example to short. And just because of the trend line, how it support and resistance on how to do the risk level, um, just little things that I really liked about this one. So... That being said, this was a great simple trade. Um, oh, my right eye is killing me. But um, didn't have any news on it, so that kind of helped. It was the 19th, so yesterday it had a lot of news or had a bunch of different things um, in the tech sector, I believe. Um, yeah, it was Lowe's Apple. But that being said, it started falling and that's when you guys you're wanting you're not wanting to only be in for these little these little falls and pop-ups you want to capture the bigger move so if you can get in at that market open or not exactly at the market open because you can see this one popped up but if you can get in where you think a great resistance is or a great support is and then watch it go the way you want it to go because it's either popping up or it's falling, it's a great way to make a huge chunk of money really fast. And then you can get out or you can put a stop loss 
and hopefully make more money as the day goes on, or you'll come back, hit the stop, you automatically locked in profits right there, there, and you're done for the day. There's no stress in this. There's no reason to stress you guys. Out. There's no reason to stress yourself out even more. So with that being said, guys, my eye is killing me. I feel like I have a lazy eye right now. I may actually. I'm, I'm not looking at myself. So with that being said, I hope you guys liked this video. I hope this helped somebody. Even if this helps one person, I'd be. That's all I want to do. So give it a thumbs up. It really helps my channel. Um, if you haven't yet, hit subscribe and hit the notification bell. That way, when I upload you automatically know and you can learn some more stuff. Um, with that being said, thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one.